Well, Cards head coach Dan McDonald describes Vanderbilt as one of those programs you just hope you don't face before Omaha, and the same can recently be said about his team. Now, Vanderbilt comes into tonight's game on an 11-game winning streak. That is the longest in the country, and the Cards are not that far behind. They have won nine straight games, and this is about the time of year that McDonald's teams tend to round into shape. At one point, the Cards were looking up to a couple of teams in the division standings, but now they're alone in first place with a four-game lead in the ACC Atlantic. Now, tonight's game is a non-conference game, so that really won't have any bearings there. But the players say it really just took some time for everyone to get comfortable, and now they feel great about where this team is headed. Our pitching staff's always there. It's always our backbone, but really it's just been our hitting the past 20 games or so. Um, it's easy to see that our hitting's really stepped up, and we're just getting an at, good at bats throughout the game from the entire lineup. You know, not just the top half, not just the bottom half, but the entire lineup just seems to be clicking at once. It's been incredible, honestly. Um, I think ever since NC State, really, when the offense kind of showed up, um, it's kind of we've been on a roll since then. It's been huge for us. We always knew this was going to be our team. It was just a matter of time before we actually showed it to the whole country. Freshman Jack Perkins will be the Cards starting pitcher tonight. Dan McDonald says that he's done a nice job coming out of the bullpen for some of the Cards ACC games this year. But tonight's game is going to be a challenge for him and pretty much anyone they send to the mound. Vanderbilt is one of the top offenses in the country. They're top three in batting average. Reporting from Jim Patterson Stadium, I'm Natalie Grace, WLKY Sports.